All right, guys, today we're playing with a NetScout Air Check G2. And what it does is uh, check your air signal to see if there's anything interfering with your Wi-Fi. So here we have a uh, 802.11 is in uh, represented in the blue color, and anything that's interference would be non-802.11 would be in the gray. And we're gonna test with a microwave here. Go ahead and fire that puppy up. We'll see how it uh, affects 2.4G here. Looks like channels 9, 10, 11, and a little bit of 12 took the most, and uh, a little bit on the rest of them. <clears throat> All right, we have a second microwave at our office. We're going to fire this thing up and watch to see what it does here. While well, the first one's still running, this one jumped up on channels uh, 13 and 14. Um, this one's not as high anymore on the 9, 10, or 11. Um, I don't know if the microwave kicks into cycles or not when it's heating your food. But, uh, yep, there's a little bit of interference coming from microwave. Not much, but maybe enough to cause something. Also on here, we have an option for uh, interferers. We can click it and then run a test. Let's turn the microwaves on. And it'll detect if there's interference in the area and trigger it as an event. Let's give it a second to load here. Pressure. Come on, do it. <laughs> All right, we got one that popped up here. Possible interferer. Pass the signal there is a negative 23. And uh, yeah, it has identified the microwaves as being a possible interferer. Another neat feature this has is to uh, show a, a client list on here. Everything you see is in the air. So we have a Roku device. And there it is. Gives you the signal strength of that device. Another cool thing is it tells you the uh, network that it's probing for. So it's looking for this particular Wi-Fi SSID. So yeah, those are the basics for the NetScout. Pretty cool little tool to uh, analyze your Wi-Fi. So. Yeah, I think it's a pretty cool tool, and it works pretty good. We've been testing it, and uh, we're going to go test it in the field here in the next couple weeks. So thanks for watching.